Jesus said? The kingdom of God is here. Some people were like, Did you hear what he said? This could be the one we've been waiting for. Others were like, But isn't the Messiah supposed to be a great military leader that'll free us from the big bully Romans that always tell us what to do? Jesus didn't look like the kind of messiah they were expecting. And Jesus said, follow me. And they did. They put down their fishing nets and followed Jesus. And then... Then Jesus kept on collecting more people. Philip, Bartholomew, Thomas, another James, Thaddeus, another... Forever kind of life in the kingdom of God. And what will we do after we start living this kind of life? What will you do? You're going to teach it to the whole world. Jesus was... We're just kind of regular people. Look, I'm trying to correct this, guys. <laughs> yeah, guys, I was actually in a rush because I need to do this, you know, before I step out. is absolutely not good you know i wanted to actually kind of share this moment with you but look guys <laughs> yeah but i did my devotion you know <laughs> this i think this period you know kind of festive season i told myself you know that i'm gonna focus on actually <laughs> renewing my knowledge you know what about jesus you know yeah I, I know some of the things, but it's kind of, you know, I go over again, you know, so that I kind of bring that freshness to, to my mind and meditate upon Jesus because Jesus is the reason for a season, you know. One of my moms here from USA always remind me that and remind everyone in the comment section that thank you so much and yeah. <laughs> yeah, guys. I feel like sleeping again. Oh my gosh, guys. You know? You see, guys, I ended up taking a nap. Ah, I don't know why I'm tired this morning, you know? Thank you. 
Books. Wow, this one is good. Prayer gym. Oh my. This is the resident. This house. Yeah, guys, I'm happy, you know. Yeah, today I'm not actually very, very, very tired, you know. I was a bit exhausted today. I kind of feel fresh, and I went out actually, guys. I'm gonna give you kind of a haul. You know, I went to that mall so that I kind of support my friend who actually sells books there. He actually sent me books through WhatsApp to say, Hey, Pelo, we have books that are on discount for Black Friday, something like that. She knows that I like books so much, guys. You know, I actually just got one so that you know I kind of support her so <laughs> i didn't actually want to be tempted because i have books i am still reading right now and yeah so guys guys we have this i'm gonna show you what i got guys you know mm -hmm. this takes me for a month guys you know <laughs> my hair has been itching you know <laughs> and I got this <laughs> such a very good book guys you know Look at the first few pages. <laughs> you write uh, <laughs> prayer request, these pages. Oh my gosh. Then, mm, then you write your worries here, just like the Bible says, be anxious for nothing by prayer and what, what, you know. And here you write what you are praying for, you know, after you go through all this process. I think it kind of makes sense to me, you know. And it, it has got these pages again that are so pretty, you know. Oh my gosh, look. Prayer is both something like this in between scripture and meditation. One is very captivating, look. Oh my gosh, guys. Phone sounds. Oh my gosh, then they gave you the encouragement, you know. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's so heartwarming, guys, you know. 
I think it's pretty cool because it will actually take you through your process, your journey with God, like your prayers, and you know what? It's kind of you know what? I can't. Oh my gosh, this thing is so good. And you write this thing on a weekly basis, which I'm really cool about, you know, because I normally journal like every day and it's not gonna actually affect my my everyday journal what what <laughs> I like it guys, you know. I couldn't actually resist this. When I saw it I was like I'm getting it, you know. Hmm? Huh? I didn't actually want to get any like book for reading and what what you know ah i think i have read so much i really need to put some of the things into practice you know before i stuff myself with a lot of reading reading and reading all those kind of self-help books guys you know you have to read them and do it rather than they they actually can be very very addictive you know what you just read 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 just like you eat 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 without waking out it's not actually good you have to actually kind of balance it up you know mm, i like this one guys you know i love god so much you know god is good god is god is my everything you know i kind of realized that nowadays i kind of concluded that i'm gonna live for god like I have been living for God like that kind of thinking to kind of realize that there's nothing actually to live for on this earth, you know. <laughs> oh my gosh, all things are vanity after vanities. Yes. Oh, thank you so much guys. Now I'm preaching. my supper.